uh, picking out your outfit for tomorrow? Uh, I, I, I picked it out. I picked it out. Yeah, I mean. This one too? Uh, yeah. I dress myself, you know. That's uh, good. Yeah, but yeah, I picked it out. It's, it's not anything, you know, over the edge, but it's, it's pretty nice, I think. Right. A lot of guys in this room have, you know, big draft range. Yours seems to be five or six. Uh, would you say that that's accurate? Um, I don't know. You have to ask the teams. I mean, you know, teams, you know, they don't give out, you know, full information. They don't make anything final. So, you know, um, I don't, I'm not I'm not expecting anything. I don't want to put myself in that position. But tomorrow night, if I get caught at five or six, I definitely won't have a problem with it. Right. What uh, you've been kind of selective about who to work out for, you know, not for. I don't think he worked out for Golden State or Minnesota. What, what was the, the reasoning behind that? That was uh, that was something that my agent chose, and um, you know the reason behind that. Uh, uh, that's the decision we made. That's that's basically it. Uh, how uh, any when you were invited to the to the green room, was there any thought that maybe you want to stay home watch it with your family, or was there any any hesitation whatsoever about this? No hesitation at all. I mean, this is this is any basketball player's dream, and. Uh, I definitely would not pass up an uh, invitation to do something like this. Yet. Are you? I've been reading your Twitter feed a little bit, and it seems like you're you're ready for this process to be over with. Um, I mean, not. I mean, I want. I, I just want to get drafted like anybody else. I mean, it's, <laughs> it's it's nothing was wrong with the process, but I mean, you just you just want to be able to say you know you, you you've, you've made it and you know you're on the team now. You're in the NBA. Um, but I enjoy the process a whole lot. Are you gonna keep going with the Twitter feed? You've been, you got some good stuff up there. Uh, yeah, I'm trying. You know, I'm trying to stay out of trouble with it though. You know, you know, once you get to the league, it's a little bit more restriction. So I'm just gonna, you know, try to just, you know, have fun and entertain people, but um, try to stay out of trouble. Did your agent David Falk ever call you and say, Greg, you gotta take that down right now? No way. Uh, oh no, no, he doesn't. Um, you know, like I, I try to monitor it. You know, I try not to, you know, put anything too serious. I just try to have fun. You know. Make people laugh and you know have conversations with people, you know, having fun. But I don't, I don't try to put anything serious that you know someone will have to tell me to take it down. Right. Unlike some other players, you don't really talk a whole lot about basketball on there. Do you watch a lot of basketball in your free time? Yeah, I watch basketball all the time. But you know, you know, I, I you know, I'm a basketball player. I, I try to you know, you know, on there, just you know. I may, I may make a few comments, but, you know, I, I don't want to just talk about basketball. You know, a lot of people, you know, kind of get bored. You know, they think that's that's all you're going to talk about. So, uh, you know, I try to talk about it as much. And plus, I don't really like talking about basketball players or anything else like that, you know, commenting on games. Right. What other interests do you have outside of basketball? Um, anything. Uh, I like to watch movies. You know, lately there's been a lot of good movies out. Uh, go bowling and just hanging out with my friends. Thanks for your time, Greg. Good luck tomorrow.